Hi everybody, so in this video we're going to have two trips out. The first of all is first thing in the morning, have a little walk down to Primrose Hill. And then the second trip is a quick walk around the Science Museum in London. Well, I hope you enjoy it. Here we go. So here we are, it's first thing in the morning. It's a bit grey and misty today, but I think actually this kind of view really suits London. So this little walk is, is, is quite a simple one, up a small hill to a viewing platform and uh, just have this glorious view of London. It's a bit like the Parliament Hill view, but to be honest, um, it's a little less sweeping and a little bit more detailed and it's a bit more calm in a way so definitely recommend this place for people who, like especially if you're on lunch just want to have a, a relaxed look at the scenery even on a cloudy rainy misty day it's just slightly different and it has a different appeal to with each atmosphere so definitely recommend that to you and here we are looking around the park a little bit not the biggest of parks but it's nicely presented and quite clean and here's the main event of the day here we are at the Science Museum. I haven't been here in ages and in some ways this is one of those places that's kind of like brings out the big kid in me because well when I had been previously it was very much hands-on engaged with the science kind of museum and uh, it's still quite fun. It's not quite as fun as it used to be though. I'm mean, like there's no real hands-on, I'm guessing because of COVID. And I just really like this uh, little piece on the roof there. It just went past with the uh, bikes. I thought it was a real nice touch as you came, came into the venue. There seems to be a bit of a strobing thing going on with the uh, the lights, but uh, I don't think it's anything overtly bad. And uh, yeah, this place is just gorgeous. I'm like really beautifully high ceilings. The whole place has got a lovely feel to it. And uh, regarding science, there's a bit for most people. Like, there's quite a concentration on industrial uh, revolution and aeronautics and space travel. But uh, in general, it's a lovely place to go. And the building itself is just glorious. It's very busy with uh, school children this, um, on this day. So I've tried to avoid any kind of filming. But... Uh, Anyway, I'll uh, just let you enjoy the scenery. There's not a lot to say. It's just a little uh, selection of highlights from a walk around the museum. So I'll leave you with it and I'll be back.
Well, this comes to the end of a little uh, highlight of the experience of the Science Museum. As I said, it wasn't quite as uh, hands-on as it used to be, but it's still a beautiful building. And uh, we also enjoyed the IMAX experience, which was uh, the Antarctic, and it was really beautiful. I definitely recommend that to everybody. And they also have a bit of concessions in there, which is quite nice as well. Um, I hope you enjoy this, and... I'll see you soon. Bye now.